calling support. This is Linda. How may I help you? Hello, Linda. I just got a, an email oh, about the about a receipt from Amazon with Geek Squad. Okay. Mm-hmm. Is a, it's a four hundred and nineteen dollar total, and I don't have this. Okay, you don't have Geek Squad. You did not order it. What is your concern, sir? I never ordered this, and yet I'm getting a receipt. You never order it, okay? I can pull up the records. So can I have your email address? Yes. $419 charge? That's right. Yes, so there is a protection. It's a gift spread, a year protection. It shows $419 that was charged on your account today. But is there, there is anyone else who might use their Amazon account? No, that's not possible. I don't have anyone else here with me. Then it means someone might have hacked your account, sir. Because this order has been charged on your account. No problem, I can do one. Then you received this invoice today? It was yesterday and I just checked my uh, Gmail. That was yesterday, okay. I'll do one thing, sir. I'm going to reset this whole account and cancel this purchase right now. Before we go further, sir, I'll be sending you the one-time verification code on your email. You need to verify that. That is for the customer privacy. Are you able to access your email right now? Yes, ma'am. Okay, go back to your email. Check you should receive another email from Amazon now. All right. I'm not seeing it. Uh, how long does this normally take? If you, it only takes you a second, sir. Can you refresh your email? It depends on your internet speed. Just refresh your email. Oh, yes, my uh, internet speed. Okay, I got the code. Okay, right. And you should receive a code on your cell phone as well. Do you have your phone number and then 81? Uh, and a pizza, do you have your cell phone handy with you? Uh, yes, I'm calling from it. Uh, you are calling from the number and then 41. But the number that's registered with this account is ending in 81. Do you have an access of that number? Uh, no, that was burner phone apparently. I've got a bunch of phones, sorry. Sorry. I'm sorry, I did not get you what you said about the number. Yeah, that was old phone. I have a bunch of phones. Bunch of different jobs, you know. The thing is that, sir, this, this is a primary number on this account. In order to cancel any transaction, we need to verify the email and phone number. So we have sent the code on that number. You have to provide me if you are able to access that number. Okay, uh, let me see if I got that phone here. Okay, check that. Ah, uh, yes, buried under receipts. I'm sorry, what you're saying? Oh, it's nothing. Oh no, this phone ran out of service not in the service so it's not possible to access that number uh, no I know the number but uh, I can't access it yeah we have sent the code there 
I'll do one thing, and then in that case, I can go and dispute the charges on my end. Verify the last four numbers of your card, sir. That is registered with your Amazon account. I didn't have a card attached to that one. I'm sorry, what you did not have? I did not have a card attached to that account. Sir, this is a debit card that was used. Do you have your debit card with you? You just need to verify the last four numbers so I can match with it and I can dispute it. Uh, let's see. Uh, I don't know how it's possible I have a card. Hmm. Yes, you just tell them they do, that you don't have a card on it and they, they hang up. Oh yes, I'm gonna call it back. Yeah, circuit's busy. Okay, let's see. Thank you for calling support. How can I help you today? Yes, I got a uh, an email about a. Uh, about a receipt from Amazon Geek Squad. Mm -hmm. And, uh. How can I? Yes, I don't get, uh. How can I help you with that? Yeah, I don't uh, use Geek Squad, so I don't know why I'm getting a receipt for it. No problem, let me check that for you, sir. Um, does it give you any order ID or any invoice number? Yes, it gives me invoice number. Please help me with that. Okay, it's a... N is in nail. S is in star. D... Thank you very much for that. Also help me out with your email address. Ah, uh, yes. Email address. My... Email address is yes, it's V as in Victoria, A as in Altel, N as in Nail, P at gmail.com. Gmail That's right. Thank you very much for that. Just give me a moment. I need to verify I'm talking to the right person. I'm sending you a six-digit verification code on your text. Can you check your text messages and verify me with that code? Yes. It's 000173. Thank you very much for that. And tell me, are you the only one using this Amazon account or do you share it with anybody else? Uh, I shouldn't be sharing it with anyone else. Like, okay, there should... what I can see here is that... Uh-huh. I mean, I had a visitor before, just a uh, Russian friend of mine. Okay, because what I can see here is that this account of yours is active in six other locations right now. Let me tell you which are the locations I have found here. Just let me know, do you know anybody from any of these locations or not? And the locations are Texas, Mexico, Ohio, New York, and the other location are international, which are Russia and China. I mean, I know uh, my friend Vlad over in Russia, 
but uh, I don't know anyone else in the other areas. It's an hacking attack you're facing here, sir. Somebody hacked you from this location, and they're using your account here. Can you tell me one more thing? Besides that uh, subscription, the Geek Squad subscription, there is one more order which has been uh, ordered for a MacBook Pro. Have you ordered any MacBook Pro? Uh, no, ma'am. And can you tell me, uh, do you, there is one card on this file, which is a Wells Fargo Platinum debit card, ends in 1971. Is that card belongs to you? No, ma'am. I only use PayPal for this. You only use PayPal? That's correct. Uh, you don't have any Wells Fargo card? No, ma'am. Um, may I know how many credit and how many debit cards do you hold under your possession? I only have one and that's, uh, and that one's expired. Uh, you have just one card and that is also expired. Yes, it's a Chase Bank card that is expired. It expired last year. So I went from there last to year. PayPal. Okay, now you have a PayPal card. No. I haven't got my card in yet. Oh, okay. So right now you don't have any credit or any debit cards under your possession, right? No, ma'am. The chase went through shutter. Okay. okay, I will do one thing here. I will just go ahead and uh, just discontinue this Amazon account of yours, okay? I will just delete this Amazon account of yours. You can create a new one and the charges has been already cancelled. Okay, thank you. Anything I can help you with? Uh, that is all. I just wanted to get this resolved because this is outrageous. $419 for Geek Squad. Yes, I understand this. Uh, your things have been cleared up. You are good to go. Thank you for calling in Amazon. Have a great day, sir. Thank you. Wow. Lady not even trying. Well, thank you for watching this. I, I hope this was amazing. Uh, I don't know, it could have been scam because uh, I don't even have a uh, an Amazon account with that uh, Gmail. It's just burner Gmail. And they fell for it. But the uh, lady not even trying. <laughs> well, that was scam betting with Boris Moskovich, the uh, Russian. <laughs> Thank you for watching.